What's up YouTube? I'm Tech Steve and on today's video I'm going to show you guys the Western Digital Passport Go. Now first of all I want to thank Western Digital for sending this over to me to show you guys what it's all about. Now a Passport Go is a portable hard drive that uses a solid state hard drive so you can actually back up your files, your computer, and also transfer pictures and videos. So sit back and relax let me tell you all about it. Taking a closer look at the Passport Go, it's about the size of a deck of cards, but almost half the size. And it also has a USB cable built right into it. They do make this Passport in two different colors. Today I have the amber one, but they also make a blue one. And it's available in two different sizes. Here I have the 500 gigabyte, but they also make one terabytes if you need that additional storage. Another thing about this Passport is very durable. You can drop it up to six feet and it'll keep on working. But the one thing I want to do now is show you how fast it is compared to some other hard drives. These are the traditional hard drives that are found in laptops and computers. And I'm going to show you guys the speed difference between these and the Passport. First, we have this hard drive, which is a 5400 RPM hard drive, which is pretty much found in just about any computer out there. And here we have a 7200 RPM hard drive. I'm using this adapter to get power and USB connection over to this hard drive. And the program I'm using is by Blackmagic that does a disk speed test so I can show you guys the difference. Now let's check out the 7200 RPM hard drive. Now let's see how fast the password go is. Wow, I'm very impressed with the speed results and why this is important is because whenever you're moving files from your computer over to an external hard drive, the slower it is, the longer it's going to take you to get things done. In addition to that, if you're playing any kind of videos off that external hard drive, it could cause buffering and sputtering and things like that. Now Western Digital did claim that this hard drive is up to two and a half faster than the average hard drive. And after doing my test, I can verify that is true. This hard drive is compatible with the PC and Mac built-in backup programs. Let me show you how to use it with Time Machine on this Apple computer. On Apple's computer, go ahead and hit the Apple's logo in the corner and click on System Preferences. Then click on Time Machine and you can select Automatic Backup. Go ahead and click on Select Backup Disk, choose your passport, and then use disk. And that's pretty much it. As you can see, there's a countdown timer before it starts backing up automatically. Now you don't have to use it, but you can log into Western Digital's cloud right here by installing the application that comes on the hard drive when you first plug it in. You'll need to go and sign in and then you can create a syncing folder. There's also the application where you can do utilities as well as security. The last thing I want to tell you guys about this hard drive is that most smart TVs will find it. So if you have movies on your computer, you can drag them over, plug it into the back of the TV and be able to watch those files over a friend's house. Also, I want to tell you that this is also powered off your computer. So there's no need for any type of extra connections and it's very, very fast. And I think you guys would enjoy it. If you want to learn more about it, I'm going to leave all those links in the description below. And thanks a lot for watching my video. Give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you guys on my next video. Peace. Thank <laughs> you.